What's going on, Capricorn family? Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, family. It is this period of isolation. After removing yourself from a lot of unnecessary conflicts and drama, you taking control of what you have going on and the repeating numbers 4-4, four, four, the emperor and the four wands, that is bringing a lot of abundance. That is bringing in a lot of opportunities, not just career-wise and financially with this Eight of Pentacles. I see several repeating eights. But also with this Knight of Pentacles, new solid and stable love opportunities with a lot of potential. Capricorn, welcome and welcome back to my channel. This is Down to Earth Tarot. Please hit that like button because it helps me out so much. Subscribe for my daily Capricorn readings because 54% of you are not subscribed. And family, let me know where you are watching from. Drop your sun, moon rising. Always big shout out to the watchers in Michigan. Family, and I said this in my previous readings, check the playlist, that a lot of blessings are coming your way, family. But you had to remove yourself Okay, from the nonsense, the five of wands and the five of cups, fours, fives, eight, eight, eight. Please drop the repeating numbers you've been seeing lately. It is leaving this person, place, situation behind that's brought a lot of heartache. Very tough for you to go. But once you go, once you left, fam, Abundance, abundance, abundance. The first thing that's coming out here is the sun. This Leo Sagittarius energy, Leo right next to it with the strength car. Opportunities, brand new beginnings. Especially for those of you Capricorns that have your hands in multiple things. So not just your career, but side hustles or possibly even starting a new business. It is when you are alone, moving in silence in which you need to do that. And not only that, Capricorn, notice how we have multiple hands here grabbing. There are a lot of people that want to get your attention, not just to pursue you romantically, but also to connect with you, network with you when it comes to business. It's this getting yourself together quietly that has you highly sought after. It is this moving in silence with this strength card here and this eight of wands, all of this fire. Keeping this to yourself, even though you're excited, even though things are moving in a good direction for you very quickly, there's this need to be very hush-hush about these opportunities that are quickly making their way to you. Blessings on blessings on blessings, Capricorn. But again, all of this is coming in from you ending communication, cutting ties with people you cannot trust, liars, cheaters, thieves. Once you close this door of communication, and this is receiving communication as well as you sending communication, all of this begins to open up for you. Okay, your cup runneth over. Now we're getting into the repeating nines, water and earth here. And then it's this king of swords family. That Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. This is making head over heart decisions. Again, we see underneath this nine of pentacles, this five of cups. This speaks to you leaving a situation in which you didn't necessarily want to go. You wanted to keep the door open. Maybe it was the other party that wanted to keep the door open. But when you, when things got too messy or when you recognize a situation could not be fixed or maybe it wasn't even for you to fix in the first place, it was time for you to go. Period, point blank. And we see, okay, a, a lot of, ooh, This is you having to turn your back permanently 
from someone or something that you were repeatedly going back to or repeatedly was coming back to you and you were allowing in. We see Gemini here, Scorpio, Aries, little cancer energy with the chariot in reverse. This is you making the conscious decision back to this ten of swords to not go back somewhere. It is finished. It is done. Period. Period. Point blank. Underneath that, the emperor twice. This is you fully taking control of the situation. And again, quietly leaving the scene. Being quiet about the things that you have going on. But also, it shows that you were hurt here. You didn't want to have to leave this situation, person, place, or thing behind. I feel like this is one of those situations where you wanted to bring someone with you, but they were holding you back. Holding you back from your full potential. Holding you back from these new opportunities. And now you have the opportunity with this newfound freedom after you've released yourself from whatever this was, please drop this person sign down below. That now you have this opportunity to really grow, to really make moves. And not only that, it could be that this person that, or this situation, place, people, group, was speaking fear into you, speaking fear into your ideas. Family, you were in a situation where you could not grow, but upon cutting those ties, immediately the opportunities are showing up. Immediately you are happier, healthier, celebrating more. And notice the three cups here, things coming together once, twice. Then you see this two of cups here off to the side, little love coming in. And then it's our man cheering up top. Your cup is about to run it over, but it is going to require you to let go again of the unnecessary nonsense. This person or place with this unnecessary drama is, was holding you back, keeping you tied and stuck. And that's the, re and see, that's the reason for this. King of Swords not necessarily looking straight ahead, but notice the body language completely turned off. Completely turning himself in a different direction. You're no longer giving something your energy, especially if it's this person that, again, speaking fear into your ideas or you could not trust this person. You being completely closed off energetically to this individual. Committed to yourself. And it's not you leaving with a beef with this Hierophant. Big Taurus energy. Taurus, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. It's not a closing with the beef. It's just you understanding, especially with this King of Air energy, that you have outgrown a situation. You have mentally matured out of something, away from something. Your understanding swords down that there's no level of communication, there's no conversation that you can have to fix this situation. It is just time for you to cut ties and move forward. You making this commitment to yourself, maybe it's five months, five weeks of just focusing on yourself, spiritually getting yourself into alignment, bringing in these blessings. Connecting you to new people, new places, new opportunities that are bringing in this abundance. So take it, because we've already seen all of this. And even this emperor here, again, drop these people's signs. But it is indeed the moving in silence for Knight of Air and this Page of Pentacles that is bringing in this new stability. And I repeat, it is the moving in silence, not letting people, don't even tell people about your wins. It's not time. It is not time. Notice how in this page of pentacles, we see this peacock here, but its feathers are down. This is moving quietly and humbly, even though you may want to rub it in somebody's face. Uh -uh, it's not the time, LeBron. It's not the time. 
because here's the deal, family. This Five of Pentacles, along this journey of abundance, you are going to be tested. We've already seen the Five of Fire. We've already seen the Five of Cups. But understand this. The person that goes about this loud, proud, and wrong not being humble about these wins, trying to rub it in maybe the, these other people's faces. Family, this isn't about rubbing it in other people's faces. This is about you getting it, getting it together. The non-humble Capricorn will experience a hardship. You may have to start over. You may, um, what is the word that I want to use? Experience a bump in the road that sets you back. Not completely. That's not what I'm talking about. But for the person that is not humble, oh, you will be humbled. And we've already seen that with this strength card here. The need to move in silence and not let people know what you have going on here. Because here's the deal. Some of you are trying to prove yourselves to people that really don't care or they're only invested in humbling you. They're only invested in the downfall. And by letting them know what you're doing, what you're working on, what you have going on here, you are setting yourself up for people to intervene pull the rug out from underneath you, especially when it comes to a particular idea and putting something out there. Be humble, be quiet, be laser focused, Capricorn, especially on this new idea that you're working on. We see our queen of cups, king of wands. Let's talk about putting your blood, sweat, and tears into this new project that is taking off. See, it's not a question of if something will be successful. You're putting in all of this work and energy, right? Praying over this situation. Things are going to work out. We see the blessings coming in here. So not just that six of pentacles, but now the six of cups. Notice our strength card here, big lion in the reverse. We see this cat here. Shout out to the cat people. Hiding in the grass, moving quietly, not saying anything. Er, er, another message to keep it quiet. Also a message, Capricorn, especially those of you who are secure in the bag, all over the place, you need to save your money during this time. Save your money for that rainy day or for the next opportunity in which you have the funds or the availability to invest in it. I also feel like there's this energy of, for those of you that are working, saving your PTO. I don't think I've ever said that before. Saving your time as well. Don't take any unnecessary time off of work because you may need it to take time for something that is more important. Big Capricorn energy, Aquarius. Shout out to the Capricorn Aquarius cuspers. This is you not letting your intrusive thoughts win during this time. This is you knowing and feeling that you are in alignment right now. You are exactly where it is you need to be. And again, just like we see the multiple hands here with the six of cups reaching out, we see our girl here with the two pictures. You are seeing and understanding that there are multiple people trying to get your attention, trying to work with you, trying to spend time with you. This is you really freeing yourself from a situation in which you felt that you were stuck. It also symbolizes to me taking a major risk and getting out of this particular mindset that had you in a negative place, a negative space. Mm -mm. And we've seen the emperor and the empress. Shout out to the men and women that are tapped in. This is everything coming full circle, family. This is you being in control of your situation with that emperor, but also this is you being in a major creative space. Okay? Nothing has been given to you, Capricorn. This is all things. These are all opportunities that you have earned, big Taurus Libra. And with these big opportunities, again, that energy of saving, not just your money, but your time. 
This is slow growth. This is not quick, right? Because sometimes those fast blessings are from the devil and then, and then that's a whole nother thing. We're not getting into that today. But this is that slow, consistent growth. You working on something for a long period of time and it being extremely successful. Capricorn. It is you choosing yourself over all things. It is you getting back into spiritual alignment. It is you getting rid of the negativity, even though it was hard for you to walk away towards these new opportunities and success, family. But it is the moving in secret. It is the trusting your gut, trusting your intuition that is leading you. So pay attention. Pay attention to the voice in your head, not the crazy ones. That is telling you to move forward. That is telling you that uh, a situation is no longer for you. It's time to close the door. Listen to it. Because it is the closing of the door of one door that is opening up others. It is the ending of one chapter or one book that is starting something else. And not only that, it's the balance that is coming with it. Pisces, the fixed signs, big Libra. Capricorn, you have a choice to make. Are you going to stay where it is comfortable or are you going to take this opportunity to focus on yourself, to focus on your business, your career, you in general? Are you letting go of the negativity to allow all of this positivity in? Family, that is all I have for you today. Claim these blessings, hit the like button, subscribe. Check out my previous readings and Capricorn, I will be tapping in with you very soon. Keep it real.